Child, when I tell you the baby mama drama be catching up with these people, the baby mama drama be catching up with these people. Today, we ain't even talking about Mr. 85 Daddy, a.k.a. Future. We are talking about Offset, child. And this story mm, is a little interesting. One of his baby mamas, whatever, one of his baby mamas want more money. So let's talk about it. Let's talk about one more money, and apparently she wants him to visit the child. Listen, I'm going to give you my opinion on why he ain't necessarily all in his the other daughter's life. That's not culture, okay? You know how some people can be. All right, so listen, before we begin, please do not forget to like this video. Like it now, like it later, just like the video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm Jovi Beauty on all platforms, so please follow, please subscribe. Hit the bell notification whatever so you know whenever I drop a new video and now let's get on to this mess so the story is in TMZ it's entitled offset baby mama says we need more support I actually hate that word baby mama I do but these apparently are baby mamas, okay? So one of Offset's baby mamas is taking a rap at the court because she wants him to pony up more dough to support their daughter. Nicole Marie, oh, what is her name? Algorin, who goes by the stage name Shayla Lamore. Is she a stripper? You know he likes some strippers, child. Anyway, has filed legal doc docs making several requests but chief among them, child support for their four-year-old, Kayla. Okay, according to legal docs obtained by TMZ, who you know TMZ knows he is, mm -mm -mm, but it's all right because we want to know the T. Okay, Nicole says the Migos rapper has provided limited financial support for Kayla, but she now is looking for the judge to order more, or at the very least, a formalized court-ordered payment. Okay, so she doesn't have child support. So he gives her what he feels like giving her when he feels like giving it to her. Okay, and Docs, Nicole says they already taken DNA, DNA test that confirms Offset is Kayla's father. What's more, she said Offset has publicly acknowledged he's Kayla's father. Offset earlier this year posed with Kayla and captioned a picture of, on Instagram, Daddy's Girl. Listen, how is... Mm. Don't Offset has two girls and two boys? I always say the boys ain't never especially when your new chick got a girl got another girl girl child they got issues with your past your previous daughters but listen that's a that's another story for another day or maybe we'll get into it later i don't know child we'll see where this video goes nicole says she just wants the court to follow suit and officially recognize him as their old dad yeah make it official boo make it official she also wants Offset to have regular visits on weekends, holidays, and in the summer. So basically, he don't even really see this kid. And I, listen, can I just say that I feel like the fact that she's a girl might be the reason he doesn't regularly see her because, you know, Cardi B had a girl and, you know, chicks don't like competition for their children and, you know, they love to run off the other girl children. I know a lot of people who have experienced situations like that over the years. So we, we all know that 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 happens a lot. OK, she also. OK, so she wants him to visit on a week. Her child to see her dad. I don't think that's too much to ask like weekends, you know, every other weekend, probably holidays and, you know, during the summertime. Like what's wrong with that? Anyway. Kayla is Offset's fourth kid. Of course, he has Culture and Cardi and two sons from previous relationships. Mm. How is he the, she the fourth kid? Did he have her after? No, he's a third kid. I'm confused. Did they, did they make a mistake and mean his third kid? How old is this little girl? This, this little girl... No, she's older than she's older than culture. So she got she's the third, right? Right? Girl, now I'm confused. Anyway, I just wanted to come and bring that story because I think it was kind of jacked up. 
I don't know their personal situation, but again, I know women who have babies for men and basically want to replace the girl children they already have, especially when they have new girl children. So I found I found that story quite interesting, and I found it a little. <laughs> and I think Cardi has something to do with that, you know, culture all up in everything, but you will never see the other little girl. That's kind of sucky. That's kind of sad, and it's kind of effed up. But anyway, that's just my opinion, and I'm gonna leave it at that. But as always, I hope you live your life like it's golden because there's no other way to live it.